Oh man. So the last two or three weeks that you guys have been around, um, I haven't been, let's see. I got my angle grinder air pump. All my stuff's in my backpack. Where is my wrench? Is the wrench on the table? Um, I've had, um, uh, we've had a couple crazy weeks. So I apologize for the delay in releasing a video. We got this going on, but I'm, we're going to wait. Um, we had Manor Lords come out. We had Farm Manager World come out, which I haven't even covered yet because I just haven't had time. Um, I've had nonstop work for the last week and a half. Today, Tuesday, the 7th is my only day off this week. Um, and we've also had the puppies come to fruition. So we're selling puppies. People are coming over all the time to buy puppies. So um, the good news is we sold a bunch of the puppies and a bunch more are going in the next day or two. So um, that's good news. We needed the money from that. And it's also good to be able to get less dogs in the house. So it's been a pretty crazy couple days. So I, I want to apologize for being not having a lot of episodes of any of my videos that I normally do coming out. Um, there's just been a lot going on. So, yeah. Um, so anyway, I am, I, we're back. <laughs> I hope that I put head gaskets in. I'm not sure that I did. I know <laughs> looking at this, I'm going, I don't know. I, I think we did. I would have, I'm pretty sure I would have put those on. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. I don't remember. Did you guys remember if I put head gaskets in? I, I have to go back and watch the videos. That's where I'm at. It's been so, but we also had the farm sim DLC come out. Um, so I've had, you know, three new games, farm sim DLC, all this stuff coming out. I don't got two transmissions for some reason. What is that for? I six and V eight. I six diesel. Eh, we're not doing that. I don't know why I bought that weird. Anyway. So I apologize for my tardiness. Um, things have just been nuts and that's just how it is right now. It's going to continue. I've got a shoot in Columbus tomorrow. I've got a shoot in Marblehead on Thursday, along with a shoot in Berlin tomorrow afternoon. And somebody said I missed a screw on the water pump, but I don't, I don't see it. Oh, there it is. They did. Look at that. Good job. I forget who it was that mentioned that, but man, I don't know how you saw that because I definitely did not. Oh, this is going to go here. I got two screws on that. Or should I say bolts? Um, got a cover. Yep. Got some pistons. We should be all good on pistons. <laughs> So on my stream version of the game, I don't know if you guys saw this or not, but I put, I'm going to pull all those spark plugs. They're probably bad. Um, <laughs> I built a Neve, a Neva or Niv as they call it. And um, actually we should probably go do one more junkyard run because now that it's reloaded, we might have some pieces. I don't freaking know what I need. What's on my notepad? Nothing. Okay. Well, maybe we need to make a list. Um, Right now, I need a L for long frame left. Left long frame. I think they consider that left, yeah. And then, um, no, they consider that r passenger side is right, right? Uh, let me think about this. Yeah, because, yeah, so left. The driver's side is considered left. Okay. <laughs> I also need, um, is it right or left? Shoot. <laughs> Let's head over to the engine and look. I mean, we're going to need more, but this is what a uh, head cover left. I need a head cover right. So this is, I need a head cover, head cover right. Rigged to the, um, <laughs> I need, what is this? I need the left side manifold. This is the left, right? So this will go on here, right? Okay. That's the left side. So we know I need, I know I need an exhaust. Nope. 
exhaust, exhaust, manifold, left. I need whatever this is. Um, uh, carburetor. Let's see, do I have that? I might have one. I got a carburetor. Okay. Steering box. Isn't that for the Neva? <laughs> Springs, various other parts. Yeah, there's a starter. Once again, uh, you, we may come to find that this is not all good. I need both rockers, both uh, both rockers left and right. Rockers. Rockers! Left and right. Um, what else? I'm not going to use this. We are going to get those spark plugs out at some point. Um, get a nice drink of water, stay hydrated. Um, I don't know. I don't really know what I need on the suspension. We didn't. We sort of started working on that, but we didn't. Because, what is this? Front axle, rear axle. I swear, my stuff was not in this bad disarray before. It's kind of like all over the place now. Got tires and wheels. This is, I got one wheel. I got two wheels. Oh, there's four over here. So these are probably the ones I was going to use. Why is this one over here? What the heck? Okay, well, let's bring this over here. I don't... Maybe I was using it to prop something up or whatever. <laughs> oh, six. I got enough wheels. I don't know about tires. There's definitely some bad tires and some good tires. Yep. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. So now we go back in and take a look and see what we got. I need my, my, my ranch. So once again, we're looking for motor parts. I, there is, and I'm looking for that frame piece. That's the big one is to grab that other frame. Um, um, I don't know if I need that or not. We'll get to that. I'm not too concerned about that right now. Transfer case for a B200. Hmm. I'm pretty sure we have one of those. Let me go just double check. Yeah, I got one. Okay, I see it laying there on the ground. This is why we do it. Um, yeah. Well, another transfer case for a B200. Wow, there are lots of transfer cases. If I have a bad one today, it would be a good day to... What's this bad boy got? Okay, there's a V8. Oh, there's a really bad set of rockers. Okay, we may have to buy those. That pulley's in horrible shape. We got a pump, but we have the thermostat on the top. I need that. Whatever that is. Yeah, thermostat housing. And that's also for the... That's where the radiator plugs. So I'll grab that. Uh, anything else off this? This <laughs> a fairly used. Yeah, it's all garbage. Oh, uh, exhaust. Any manifold on this side? Nope. And another big V8 call. So one of these, we might get lucky. Um, I don't know. I, I wish I would have looked if I had the pan. We'll have to check that out because that has this has a good good uh, air filter on it. Eh, rockers are bad. Thought maybe we'd find a treasure in there, but we did not. I don't really need that off. Uh, there's no exhaust manifold on that. No exhaust manifold. Uh, we do have we have the the this one, but it's bad. Okay. Look around. Oh, and I found out that, like, and I don't know if we talked about this yet. I don't think we have. That, uh, unfortunately, I don't I don't know if the, our car has a bad camshaft or not, but we're going to have to look in again and see because, or our truck, because I didn't know that you pry, you can pry it out with a pry tool. What is Crankshaft for what? That must be for a motorcycle. Oh, what is this? Short. Crap. <laughs> What's this? What's this? Um, that looks like a good piece. 
Oh my, I think that's the one we need. Let me just go double check. I can't remember. Well, I, mo- I noted it, but I said left and I might have been lack I, I got to double check. I'm sorry. La 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 la. Um, yeah, it's going to be the left side. Okay. And what about this? What about this? Nope, camshaft's good. Okay. I don't know if you saw it there, but it looks fine. So it looks like we've got our frame. That's what we needed. Um, that's going to be on this side, right? Yep. So let's go ahead and take this bed off. We'll get this whole thing unscrewed. I know, Dayton gets screwed again. Um, head through. Don't let it slip away. What about a love? All right. Don't you want someone to share it with you? Whoa. Where did that go? Okay. Um, that bumper looks like it's in good shape. I don't know if we have that or not. But when I take the frame out, we could take a look. See, this is these are parts I don't know if we need or not. Dang it. Nope, I do have a rear bumper. We're good there. All right, back to the work. The good work. Come on. <laughs> it's like crushed. It's a crushed leaf spring. <laughs> what happened? That's beyond the limits of deformation. Was that mean this thing's all bent? I don't know. That should be the this should be the long frame. Maybe it's not. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Where's the bolt? Where's the bolt? Show me your bolt. Mm. Oh, here they are. There's one. Somewhere there. Oh, 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 there it is. There's two. Come on, snakies. Crawl on your belly like a snakey. Ah, ah, okay, there we go. <laughs> Sorry. I know I'm not funny. I know <laughs> I'm just weird. Some of you think I'm funny. Some of you just are like, oh my God, he's so weird. Okay. Let's grab this thing off. <laughs> no. Dang. I thought that would be enough. Should fall right off. There might be something in the front that's connecting it. Uh, I just want this whole thing off, please. Urgh. Oh, loosen it all up. Loosen it all up. Knock it all down, knock it all down. Take the engine off. <laughs> Take the engine off. There we go. Does this pop out? No. Yes. Oh, we might need this piece too. Front thingy. For now, I'll chuck all these pieces in the back and <laughs> we'll take a look if we need them or not. Uh, why won't this come off? I'm pretty sure some of the stuff we don't have to disassemble, but I don't I don't understand. Maybe the seat has to come out first before the cab will come off. Those look short. Those rails do not look long, but hopefully it is. It'll say once we get it broken off. Oh crap, the sun is going down. I don't know what I think they just kick us out at some point. I gotta hurry with this. Come on. Oh man. Otherwise. We got an hour. Okay. I'm gonna take this off. All this stuff has gotta come off. Come on. Let's 
Is this motor coming out yet? No. It doesn't have a transmission attached to it. It should just fall right out. What is this attached to? Nothing. Okay. Uh, hurry up. Okay, that's got to come undone. If I can just break this frame off. And these two. And this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's a rush. <gasps> it came off. Yes. Grab it. Oh, it's going to freak. <laughs> it's freaking out. <laughs> Let's get this thing loose. Okay, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. hurry up. Come on, come on, come on. Grab this. Oh, we got to move. Mm -hmm. I hope we didn't need any of this other stuff, but I guess this is the most important thing we've been. We can't do anything until we had this piece. So I need to get this. Come on. I don't need that. I might need the side panel, but I don't I need that. $200. Wow. It was expensive. Oh, and I didn't even check and see if it was the right one. Crapola. But it's going to be closed. He's done. So that was good for the day. We got the one thing that we really needed. That was expensive, though. I'm kind of. Let's see if he closes. He might be open for another couple minutes. Um, this is considered frame rail L. And I don't know. It didn't say short. I think it's short and regular. So that's how it works. So I, that looks like it's going to fit. Um, so let's put frame rail L on and see what happens. That's backwards, I think. Right. <laughs> Snap you, dang it. <laughs> Snap you fool. It must go the other way. Right. Um now that looks right. That's not promising. The fact that it's not giving me a checkbox. Check a box. Oh. That's right. I needed the short one. <clears throat> oh. Wait a minute. Is it? No. Hang on. There's that. I mean, it's only 200 bucks, but that's the wrong piece. I need the short one. Mm. Okay. Well, we need to, uh, we still got some time, but I'm not going to be able to get the thing out in time. So we need to wait till tomorrow. Dang it. There probably was one back there that I could have used. We're going to throw this on this pile for now. Let's go take a look real quick. It will just get booted if we get booted. I can always just buy a, a short frame if I need to. If we find a good piece, I can buy the whole thing and... There's a little trick with the trucks um, to sell them and make some money. So that's the one we took apart. Sorry, Joe. That's what we need. And I, I don't think the I don't know if the part's good or not. That one is bad. Bad. No, it's good. I need to see the rear end of it. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to spend the night working at our shop. Um, can I eye this? Yep, I'm going to buy it. <sighs> Risk A. Oh, that was a bad idea. Actually, I'm going to use that for money. Uh, I can't take that piece out now because we're going to need that. Um, you'll see. But we have nothing. I, I, I'm going to save up a little bit more money, so you'll see. This this will turn out okay. We'll be all right. Um, there's that. This is the truck we just bought. Like, woo, that's a crappy truck, but there's a little trick here. So we're going to go ahead and take this back. I'm going to tow it to my house. Maybe this will work. <laughs> Maybe not. And we're going to the house. So we're going to take a taxi to our house. And look how pretty it 
is out. Look at the snow. That is pretty. I like that. We should be able to get a couple hundred bucks or more out of this. Probably more. Just by cleaning it and fixing the paint. Even if we don't make it perfect, we can improve it. So um, let's go ahead and push it on into the garage. Yep. So a little bit night nighttime side repair. I really need the frame off that truck, but we'll get another one. It, it just it, it is what it is. I'm so mad that that other thing didn't work out. But this is the fun of building a junkyard truck. Sometimes you win. Sometimes you have to kind of do things over again. And that's what we're going to have to do. So the nice thing about this truck is it's not too beat up. I don't know that we have to do any Bondo, but we might. Let's see if we can clean it there. It's hard to tell if it's clean or not without the flashlight. This is a very dark purple truck. It's kind of a cool color, actually. Once again, this one might have a nicer finish than our truck. Though I am going to remediate our truck of rust and stuff like that. But I don't think it's going to be. I'm not going to. I don't think I'm going to bother painting it unless it has to be painted. Now, the pain with this one is that we're going to have to do a decent amount of painting on this because. The goal is to get the, the paint to be four or five stars. That's where we're going to get our money. Um, it's kind of funny how these work, but. But we're going to make some money quick tonight, so that'll be good. So I'm going to go ahead and finish cleaning this up. Uh, the next step we'll do is uh, we'll get the the, uh, the the chopper out and start cutting the, the rust out. So once we're done, we're almost done washing this. I think I have to climb into the bed, though, and wash it, too. Oh, we got to open the door. <laughs> the one door. Open the door. But see, if we can get this to a clean state, then that already, that already greatly induces, increases our clean states up to four. Look at this. We've, we've made, like, $2. It's great. See how good that worked? It's worth... But the, the point is, it's actually worth what we paid for it. So um, usually the price goes down when you buy it. So we're still, we're back up again. But for every star that you go up, you get more. So come on, jump. Oh, God. Dude, this guy cannot climb into the back of a pickup. <laughs> All right, there we go. We got in, though. We did it. It's funny how things with like weird angles and stuff don't get cleaned. This is all nice though. A lot of it doesn't have rust. That's good. A lot of different colors though. This is weird how the bed's one color and then the outside's another. The cab's another color. So we're going to have to homogenize this whole thing into one color. All right, now let's take a look and see what the stars look like. We've improved nothing, <laughs> but at least it's clean. Okay, so hang the hose up, and I need to get my angle grinder, which is probably in my pocket. Yeah, I'll put that out there. Where's my grinder wheel? Uh, what did I do with the wheel? <laughs> Hammer, screwdriver, spark plug, socket, wrench. Mm. Dang it. I'm going to have to grab a tool. I hope that the shop is still open. It snowed in my house. Lovely. Spark plug, wrench. All right. So um, let's. Well, yeah. I'm going to have to take it. Yeah. Taxi to junkyard, taxi to sign, taxi to house to garage. Hopefully the gas station will still be open. Yeah, 
Yes. Okay. Hey, I'll take a taxi home. <laughs> okay. So. Take our disc and put it on this thing. Yep. And put that away. Grab that. Okay. I don't know if that's going to work or not, but rust is really weird. Sometimes it just disappears like that. Other times you can't even get it. But if we can get this the paint job up, this will improve our score a lot. I hate the fact that we had to do the hood. Hopefully the truck is blue. Because the roof looks good. Oh, it's dirty. That's part of the problem there. Need to hop up with the hose and grab the roof. Yep. Come on, grab it. <laughs> um, okay. There we go. Is there? Hopefully there's no rust on the roof. It gave us a five-star clean state. I'm hoping that this is the base color that we're seeing here and not the purple. I think it probably is. I didn't really look at the base color, but I have glimpses. <laughs> okay, so um, let's see what this says about rust. There's okay rust. Uh, what's the price right now? 59. Now, that, that increased at several hundred dollars there just doing that. Um, There's a lot of rust on the frame, but we're not, once again, I'm not going to mess with the framework. I'm not, that's not what we're doing here. We're just, just getting the truck painted back to original color. Uh, you could do it and you could make more money. And once again, the, the sky's the limit with what you want to do with these. The more you work on them, the better they get. But um, you also are going to, you know, I'm, I'm not going to put parts into this. And unfortunately to replace those things, you have to put parts in. So... Oh, this wouldn't have worked either. I feel better now about this truck and not being able to use it. This is a long frame truck. I don't know why I didn't recognize that when I saw it. We need a short frame. Oh, weird. Okay. I, I could have sworn it was a short, but it's not. It's long. Right? That's the long cab. Yeah, it is. It's got the space behind. Okay, so the color. Well, first of all, let's grab this. See if there's anything that needs. There's some rust there that we could remediate. Okay. But n nothing else, really. Okay, so I'll need the uh, pry tool. And we're going to pry this off. And I'll put that back over here and grab it. And grab this tool. And we're going to clean this up okay just looking along that line again looks good oh, looks good okay all right and put this back here and let's take a look at the color the color is going to be that dark color good e o e o 10 d o e o Tandy. <laughs> Sorry. That's how I remember it. Color. You guys remember it? It's O E O Tandy. <laughs> uh, I think that's the right color. Yeah, like a plum. We we'll probably need two of those. God, I hope not more because we're really running out of money. Um, that's going to be this part. Yeah, that looks right. Ooh, it looks so right. Ooh, truck. You're looking much darker purple. Ooh, truck. You're going to be worth lots of bank. Probably. I think we'll make about a thousand bucks on this. It's not too bad.
But you can pick up quick projects like this. Quick projects pretty quickly. And that's kind of the fun part about the game. I don't. Yes, it's fun to fix people's cars and stuff, but the most fun I find for myself anyway is to do this kind of stuff. <laughs> oh, great. Visible paint. Uh, what about this? Is there. Yeah, see, there's still some spots here, too. Got that whole panel done. If you want to do a really nice job, you probably should pull all the panels off and paint it that way. Um, this is a little bit. Uh, like. <laughs> cheap. Cheap and easy. It's like in real life, they'd obviously have to mask this all off and stuff. Get down there. Get down on the floor. Get down on it. Sorry. All right. Oh, purple baby. Gonna paint that right. Do 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 do. We have to do the interior of the door. Well, that's all. Got to get it too. Do 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 do. Somehow I have to get that hood. Um, can I stand up? All right. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Let's get the other side of the door here. This probably will make it go up all the way, I think. But we'll see. If we can get five stars, it'll be the best. The best. Ah, oh, it's a good thing I bought two. That one's done. I've tried to apply carefully, but... There we go. All right, so the hosey hose. We're gonna put that there. Grab a hose. I'm gonna wash this off. Some crud there, yep. Okay, I think that's all the painting we can do. Let's take a look and see what we did. Yep, almost, let's see, we had 5,000. I think we paid just just over five thousand bucks, so it's not perfect. It's still got rust. It's still got not perfect color, but we made about almost two thousand dollars for that little night soiree. And I'm gonna lay down now for the night, and that should be good. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Have a great night. Be sure to subscribe, thumbs up, voice up, and we'll see you as we continue to build my truck.